In this exercise, let's take our DSL example a step further and make it a little bit more complicated. Now I want to know which are the courses that must need a student to have a Linux as one of the skills and cost less than $250. Or give me a list of courses that may require Java as a skill but they are starting in year 2017. This query is a little bit long, so let's take it in the terminal. Okay, so let's open this file, tq2.curl. Here you can see it's a post command, okay? And we are doing a search. And this query is also bool type query, okay? And within that, we have two conditions now. One is must and the other is should, okay? So must is like and case, okay? You must have this and this happening together, okay? Should is this may happen or this may happen or both may happen, okay? So it's something like that. So here for this particular example, we want the course must require a skill of Shava and its fees is ranged less than $250, okay? Or we can get a course which is starting after January, okay, but ending before 31st December of January. So in 2017, whatever courses are available, give me that list. But in those courses, I'm only interested in the ones which may require Java as the skill, okay. Let's run this and see what happens. All right, so let's go up. So this time it took seven milliseconds. So this is quite a fast query, okay? Although it's complex, but it is fast. We have total five shards for our index and all five of them were accessible by this query. So, so far we good. It hit three documents, all right, that's good. And the maximum score is 1.4. So it's very confident the first record is matching our expectations. All right, so let's see what is the first record. It has course ID 1002. It requires Java as a skill and it's starting in February 2017. Okay, so this is satisfying our second criteria of having a course starting in 2017, which may have Java as one of the skills. Let's see the next record. This is for course ID 1011. This one does not require Java, okay? But it's also starting in 2017 and its fee is $59. So this is satisfying our first criteria, which was the course should cost less than $250 and must have a skill as Linux. Okay, let's see the next record. This is course ID 1003. And here the skill has Linux. It is costing less than $250. So this is also satisfying our first criteria. All right. I encourage you to try out more queries, play with these uh, values within the query and see what kind of results you get, okay? And you can also go on Elasticsearch website to find out various other options you have for searching, okay? There are many different kinds of searches you can do over your cluster, okay? But in this course, we only have some introduction about the searches and give you a feel about what kind of searches you can do over Elasticsearch, okay? In the next section, we will talk about integrating Elasticsearch with Hadoop ecosystem.